What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be unboxing a Marvel mystery box for my local comic book shop, Entertainment Inc. This comic book shop's about 25, maybe 30 minutes away from me, but it is the closest one that does these mystery boxes. This cost me $35 Canadian, and it does say inside that the value is anywhere from $35 to $50 US, or $50 to $70 Canadian. Now inside there's a possibility of getting Funko Pops, graphic novels, action figures, comic books, posters, buttons, and a lot more. And it also says at the bottom that no two boxes are the exact same. So depending on what we get in here, if I think the value is worth it, I might try to get a few more in the future and just check them out at $35. That to me still is a great purchase and will probably make me want to buy a few more in the future. But let's open it up and take a closer look. So inside, this is really packed well. Um, they do have two bubble wraps uh, inside, so everything's not bouncing around, which I do like. Now, uh, the first thing here that I see, I'm just gonna get some of the small stuff out of the way. There is a little Daredevil pin inside, which is cool. Put that off to the side here. Uh, we do have a keychain. This is a Deadpool keychain. And it does say, to be continued dorks, which is really, Funny. So this is probably going to go on my uh, truck keys. I've been looking for a new keychain anyway since I got my new truck. This one does look like it's going to be perfect and it is solid. It's not a plastic one, it is a metal one. So very cool stuff already. Next we do have uh, a Marvel Mania. I'm just going to rip it open here and see what this is. I've never seen this before. It's pretty cool. Uh, inside is this little Groot's figure, let it focus there, uh, with the bottom that appears to be a suction cup. I'm um, assuming it's going to go on my Marvel shelf anyways. And yeah, it's a little suction cup, so that's pretty cool. Next up is a comic book, but it also has a figure with it. Uh, chess, Marvel Chess Collection. Not familiar of who this is, but... Uh, it says it's White Pawn uh, Cyclock, probably pronounced that wrong, uh, but it is, it looks like a chess figure for a chess set. Um, it says the value of this is $21.99, so that's cool, at least it tells me what this one was worth. So that is pretty cool, I'm not really sure of who it is, or if that's even her name down here, or if I pronounced it right, but it does look cool, it looks like a nice figure. Pretty cool stuff so far. Now it looks like, uh, I thought this was like a little decoy, but it looks like it might be a fold out poster. Let's see here, really hard to show it, but it does say black hat there. Really big poster. Well, that's really cool that they include a uh, big poster as opposed to some of the small posters that we see. Um, there is comic books now. So I'm just gonna grab them here. We have the Ultimum uh, Spider-Man, which is cool. This is uh, one of two limited series, and we actually have two of two as well. So we have a complete set uh, for these, which is gonna be awesome. I've again been getting back into comics, so these are definitely worth checking out. While I was there, I also did purchase a comic book uh, the Beast issue number two, of course, I'm not sure where I said it already. I probably already put it in one of my boxes next to me. Uh, but that was pretty cool that they do have comics, so I browsed through a bunch of the stuff as well. Um, and this, I think, might be the last thing in here yet. Yeah, this is just a decoy left. And that is a graphic novel, The Mighty Avengers, which looks amazing. And it does say the value is $15 US. Uh, so that is pretty cool. So I believe I did get my value out of this box. It was only $35 Canadian. I know these books are almost $20 Canadian uh, whenever you buy them in the stores. Uh, the comic books, it's a complete set. I'm not exactly sure what that's worth, but we did get a keychain, a pin, and a few other cool items as well. So for $35, I think this was an amazing mystery box that a lot of comic book shops now don't really do mystery boxes anymore. A lot of people do believe that mystery boxes are a way of these comic book shops to get rid of their crappy inventory, but this was a really, really great mystery box. 
and I did love all the stuff that was in it. So it was really, for the value, it was really worthwhile, and I'm likely going to purchase a few more in the future. Comment down below if you guys are interested in seeing more of these unboxed on my channel, but something local, whenever they do stuff like this, I've been looking for mystery boxes locally for a while, and now that I found one that does it, and it's great value, and it only cost me $35, I think I might buy a few more in the future. And of course, there is possibilities of getting Funko Pops, action figures, and other things out of this mystery boxes, which makes me want to buy more. So I did get great stuff out of this one, but there possibly could be other cool stuff that I could get in future boxes. So hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. I'll leave this one here. I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.